everybody, welcome back to another walkthrough of Let's Play Grand Theft Auto Vice City. Anyway, I'm going to do the first mission for Rosenberg. I think there's like only like four Rosenberg missions or something, but anyway, I'll have to check it out. I'll let you guys know later. Okay, here's the first one. Go get some sleep, he says. <laughs> I have been sitting in this chair all night with the lights off drinking coffee. This is a disaster. We are so screwed, man. These gorillas, listen to me, are going to come down here and rip my head off. It's re ridiculous. I did not go to law school for this. Okay, now what the hell are we going to do? Shut up. Sit down. Relax. I'll tell you what we're going to do. You're going to find out who took our cocaine. And then I'm gonna kill them. That's a good idea. That's a great idea. Let me think, let me think, let me think. Oh, there's this retired colonel, Colonel Juan Garcia Cortez. He's the one that helped me set up this deal well away from Vice City's established thugs, okay? Now listen, he's holding his party out in the bay on his expensive yacht, and all of Vice City's big players are gonna be there, okay? I have an invite. Of course I have an invite. But there's no way that I'm going out there sticking my head out the door. No I way. I told you, happen. shut up. I'll go myself. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, I like 1978, too, but, you know, this isn't going to be a beer and strippers, do. I mean, no offense, but I think that you might turn heads on the runway for the wrong reason. What's wrong with the way I'm dressed? Okay, look, here. Stop by Raphael's. Tell him I sent you. He'll make you look respectable. Okay, go. Come on. Who's that guy think he is? Now I got to dress like a chump as well as hang out with him? I like this shirt. <laughs> Okay, everybody, we're going to go to Raffles. This is the first game to feature changing clothes. Like, they're all scattered in different areas. You didn't have a wardrobe like you did in um, Vice Sea Stories or in Liberty Sea Stories. So they will be scattered all over the place. I have cut the music out because of the copyright. So there will be no music in, this walk in the walkthroughs. I'm sorry. I had to cut it out in order for copyright violation. So anyway, here I go to Raphael's. You got ID? Hmm, nice bike. Okay, guys, that's a freeway because they were popular back in 2002. And they're introducing us to something new because this is the first game to feature the, the Autobot bikes right here. So those are going to be new to us. It this game also featured helicopters, seaplanes, and whatnot. So you'll be seeing them as well later on in the game. Right now, I'm early on in the game on the Western Island, which is right here. That's the Eastern Island right over there. We'll unlock it later after so many missions, but anyway, take the bike. No, my bike. Yep, the sorry there's no music. No. Try just get out of the way. It's so hard sometimes to do steer on iPad. So anyway, here we go to the Colonel's yacht. He says all of Vice's big players are gonna be there, which I can't wait to meet them. Hey, yeah, but anyway, most of them will appear later on, I think. I don't know. But anyway, we're going to the yacht. And then it's right over there. That big boat is. Too bad there's not one here in El Paso. My mom would have been going. I would have went too, because I'm, I met a lot of celebrities due to my mom. Because she works for a, a news a magazine company. So anyway, she will be doing, I be, she does that, writes articles and interviews with people, and I'm doing these walkthroughs. So anyway, here we go. Buenas noches. I understand you are here on the behalf of Mr. Rosenberg. I hope any recent problems have not affected his health or mental well-being, Mr. Versetti. He's just got a touch of 
Agoraphobia. <laughs> excellent, excellent. And you? I just want my merchandise. Ah, it's an unfortunate set of circumstances for all involved. Of course, I have initiated my own lines of inquiry, but such a delicate matter will take time. Perhaps we will talk later. Meanwhile, let me introduce you to my daughter. Miss Davis! Karamia, could you look after our guest while I attend to my necessary obligations? Of course, Daddy. Please, excuse me. Mercedes? You try living with it. Anyway, let me point out some of our more distinguished guests. That's our Congressman Alex Shrug with rising silicone star, Candy Sachs. And have you met my lovely wife, Laura? No? Well, uh, unfortunately, she's in Alabama. This is Candy. And over there, we have the Vice City Mamba's star titan, BJ. Always the charmer. I blocked down on him, and then I put him in a wheelchair. <laughs> <laughs> that is good. Well, now, I'm looking at some prime... And that poolside amphibian is Jez Torrent. Lead singer with Love Fest. Yeah, can I tell you, do you know how they play ping pong? In silence. Let me tell you. It does not involve a battle if you know what. Important. And the chatty trio, that sleeping sweat gland is Papa's right hand gift, Gonzalez. And the other two are Pastor Richards and pseudo intellectual film director this Steve all Scott. Throws a passion with the Nympho invaders when the giant shark comes in and just bites their dicks off. You never saw anything like that before. Colonel, your party's as if a triumph. <laughs> I can only apologize. Oh, the not, amigo. How do we find you? <laughs> Our business is very tried. Barbarians at the gate. A time for rewarding one's friends and liquidating one's enemies, amigo. Who's the loud now? Ricardo Diaz is Mr. Cole. Mercedes! Oh, I was just taking my friend back into town. Another time, Ricardo. Ricardo, let's go. Let's get there. out of here. Sure. Actually, take me to the pole position. Drinks. Okay, everybody. We just met um so many characters. Later on, they also would appear at the game later on. If you seen them, except for Pastor Richard. He he only appears in this cutscene, but if you listen to VCPR, Vice City Public Radio. You can hear his voice on there, but other than that, the only he only appears in that cutscene. Steve Scott will appear later on. Ricard Gonzalez was in Vice City Stories, if you remember. We met him with Rennie. And um term well, Colonel Cortez was mentioned in Vice City Stories, but they didn't show him at all. I'm trying to remember who else. I know Avery Carrington, the cow, the guy with the cowboy hat who said something about prime real estate property. He appeared in Liberty Sea Stories, if you remember that. He actually did in um, Don Love as well, which is the guy next to him. BJ was the black dude. Ricardo Diaz was also in Vice Sea Stories. His mansion is right across from, I'm trying to remember where it is. I have a sniper rifle right now. I'll show you where. Okay, right over there's Diaz's mansion. Remember that in Vice City Stories? It's right here. But anyway, yeah, most of them do appear later on. Some of them don't. Well, most of them actually do. With Congressman Alex Shrub, he would appear. Candy Sex would appear later on. And the guy over there will is Ken Paul talking to them. We'll meet them. Jess Torres, lead singer with Love Fist. He's the only one there, but we'll meet the whole band later on in the game. But anyway, I like chatting with it, but let's take her to Pole Position Club and complete the mission. But we'll meet those guys later. Will you be working for my father? Maybe. Do you mind me resting my hand in your lap? Maybe. So difficult having a rich and powerful father. Vamos. That's the pole position club right there. I'm sure you will. Mission passed. Sorry guys, the music's cut out because of copyright. I'm sorry. Like, I wish I had the music. But anyway, 
this pole position club right here. You get to actually own it and access it later. But anyway, that was my mission. I'll be doing the next Rosenberg one. Stay tuned.